Access Engineering PLC in their relatively short account of 14 years in the annals of construction services in Sri Lanka have reached iconic status. Their record and reputation for successfully employing new and innovative technologies have captured the imagination of professionals. Many construction or pre-construction projects have employed new and fresh technologies, placing them ahead among other competitors. Access Engineering has introduced the concept and execution of the diaphragm wall in the preliminary stages of preparation of subterranean structures at foundation levels in mega high-rise building projects. This internationally advocated exciting new development has been adopted and successfully implemented in Sri Lanka just recently. The notable advantages over other available solutions can be seen. Lower cost, quicker process, no grout used to seal the water seepage, effective in all soil, either arid or with higher water table, no extra building of wall necessary. This saves material and resources. Added advantage of digging deep even as much as 50 meters. Ideal for multi-level basement stories. Method brings greater stability and verticality. This then is the future for building basements. As part of the attendant method, there is the additional value of ground stabilizing before diaphragm wall construction. This is wrought with soil nailing and shot creating technologies. Shot creating refers to a method in concrete work in which the concrete mix is applied in layers under the pressure of compressed air. Alternatively, a flexible reinforcing mesh may be held against the soil face beneath the head plates. These additional provisions are in complete accord with green building processors. The first steps begin with constructing the guide wall. This demarcates the lines within which the grabber will dig the trenches. The horizontal ground level concreted platform ensures that the grabber will be stable on ground for the actual digging. The Bauer GB34 proceeds with amazing accuracy. Vertical trench walls are possible because of this. The magnificent Bauer GB34 is key to the success of the diaphragm wall. The very nature of the grabber bucket and its reach ensures the ability to dig vertically and maintain accuracy. Onboard computers maintain the tension so that lateral oscillation of the grabber is minimal and this adds to the effectiveness in maintaining verticality. Slurry of bentonite, which is stored in a set of silos, is applied into the trench to ensure that caving in of the sides is prevented. At the concrete pouring stage of the construction of the diaphragm wall, the bentonite slurry is taken back into the silos after desanding for reuse. This also contributes to cost saving and protection of environment. Importantly, the stop end where the elements of the wall join is maintained free of water seepage with the employment of the rubber seal. This is a crucial factor, again far superior to the usage of grouting to seal off. The Coden Test Another vital component in the armory of Access Engineering's devices for maintenance of the high standard. Notably, the rebar cage is prefabricated on site. Instead of spot welding or tying, the use of a coupler enhances workability while also saving on cost. In the dug trench segment, the rebar cage is lowered in position. Large scale cages can be lowered using this approach. The speed at which all this multiple activity can be done is notable. Pre-mixed concrete is applied. Using the double tremie, self-compacted concrete is introduced. And while the filling of the trench happens, the slurry is pushed upward to the surface. 
During the process of placing concrete through tremies into the crevice or trench, the concrete detritus with sand and other particulates is also pushed to the surface. This solid substance, which emanates to the surface, is subjected to head cutting. After hacking away the unsound head concrete, a tie beam completes a section of the diaphragm wall. Soil anchoring is the final element. The Clem machine is outstanding in its flexibility, even in confined space. This technologically advanced device drills through the perimeter and anchors a diaphragm wall with the surrounding subterranean soil. In this technique, soil is reinforced with slender elements such as reinforcing bars which are called nails. These reinforcing bars are installed into rows of holes that are bored into the soil and usually cement grout is injected under high pressure. Wedge plates provide added stability and secure the nail ends or wire rods reinforced with the cement grouting. This securing and nailing of the concrete wall structure adds to the long-term stability and verticality of the wall. In addition to this application, the Clem is adaptable in other contexts such as slope stabilization, stabilizing of vertical structures, stabilization of diaphragm walls. Quality is maintained throughout with measurements using the inclinometer. Repeatedly checks that the wall remains within the minimum allowance for vertical and lateral movement. This modern advancement in pre-construction methodology has been applied at the worksite of the ITC Tower Project on Golf Face in Colombo. Access Engineering PLC has been able to effectively and successfully deliver excellence with the diaphragm wall solution.